in the first grade, a wee little boy, he sounded like this. Oh, wowzers, what a fun-loving, optimistic child. Now remember, kids, the key to happiness is very simple. All you have to do is pick a note and go whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. That's all it is. And congratulations, you've built yourself the Ionian or major scale. Let's go ahead and do it again off of D. Once again, whole, whole, half, whole, 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 half. And wowzers, out of this fun-loving, optimistic scale came a bunch of fun-loving and optimistic music. Here's the thing, if we just use that same scale we just built and played the one, four, and five chord, we got ourselves this. So we got ourselves twist and shout. And then if we use that same scale, F sharp Ionian, okay, we get an even more fun loving song. Okay, so looks like years of classical piano training have really paid off for me. Here's the thing. That's what Derek sounded like in the first grade. But then the second grade came along, and Derek went spiraling down into a deep, dark hole of depression, which sounded like this. Okay, what happened to you, Derek? Now, here's the thing. Derek has a lot of positive forces in his life. For example, his school therapist. Oh, wow, this is what a fun-loving man. Now, here's the thing. His school therapist is G. Ionian. But every Ionian scale, every major scale, has a shitty relative, a shitty uncle, otherwise known as the minor scale, or Aeolian. Now, to find the relative Aeolian to this scale, to G Ionian, all we gotta do is play that same scale, but instead of starting off on that first note there, we started off on the sixth note. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, looks like the sixth note is E here, and we play that same scale, those same set of notes, just starting off on the sixth. So, here we have E Aeolian. Let's play down an octave. Okay, wowzers, now that's one shitty uncle right there. Okay, let's do the same thing for Derek. So that's what Derek sounds like. And once again, we can just play that same set of notes off of the sixth scale degree. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And once again, there you have Uncle Joe. Now here's the thing. We now know how to identify and find the shitty relatives, the shitty minor scales uh, that relate to our major scales. But how do we turn Derek, how do we turn this fun-loving child into a minor scale? Well, all we have to do is this. All we have to do is take the third, sixth, and seventh notes of the scale and lower them a half step. So we have the first two notes, one, two, and we take the third note and flatten it. Okay, so one, two, flat three, four, five, flat six, flat seven, and one. And here we have C Aeolian. Okay, looks like Derek's, I don't know, he's very sad. He's probably going to go listen to him some Fallout Boy or something. Let's go ahead and try the same technique with another scale here. So let's try it with... Um, the school therapist here, he's probably burnt out after having to deal with Derek's social life. Okay, so there's the school therapist there. Now, how do we turn that G Ionian scale into G Aeolian? Well, it's very simple. Same formula. Once again, one, two, flat three, four, five, flat six, flat seven, and back to one. And you might be asking yourself, hey, Underbelly, why is this natural? I thought we were supposed to play a black key here. Well, here's the thing. By default, in the original, in G Ionian, this is an F sharp. So all we did there when we went from Ionian to Aeolian is we lowered this a half step. Okay, wowzers, well, here's the thing. That's how you build the Aeolian scale. Now, we know how to do the scale, but how do we actually use this to start writing music. How do we really get to the essence of the scale? Well, let's go ahead and start building chords off of it. And for this, I'm just going to go ahead and use D Aeolian. So once again, we have D major and we want to turn it into a minor. So 
Once again, one, two, flat three, four, five, flat six, flat seven, one, there's our scale. Let's go ahead and build the chords off of it. We got the minor one, diminished two, major three, minor four, minor five, major six, major seven, and back to one. Wowzers. So it looks like it's one, diminished, two, major three, once again, minor four, five, major six, major seven, back to one. Now here's the thing, it's a lot of chords to remember. How do we find just maybe even just two chords that really get at the essence of this scale? And whenever I want to write an Aeolian, whenever I want to conjure up the feeling that Aeolian gives me, all I gotta do is listen to The Dark Knight. So here we are, key of D Aeolian. Starting with that one chord. Oh, shit! Okay, so all we did there was we went from the minor one to the major six. Two chords in the scale. And we just inverted it, so it's D minor and B flat major. Okay. And every time I hear that two chord progression, doesn't matter what song it is, I can instantly tell, blam, this is an Aeolian. And that's the vibe it gives. It's very serious, cinematic, sad. It's not only used in cinematic Hollywood music, it's also very popular in EDM. For example, Angel on My Shoulder. That first chord. F major. There's that one. We're in the key of. So we're doing six, seven, one. So in this case, we're actually in the key of A Aeolian. And we're just starting out with the six, major six. Once again, same thing as in the Dark Knight. Major seven, back to one. And then we're just cycling through. Wowzers. So that one to six relationship is really, really powerful in Aeolian, really gets at the heart of the vibe of the scale. Let's have one more example. Many of you are gonna cringe at this, but I think it's very important to learn. Okay, it looks like we're in the key of E Aeolian. One, major three, Major seven, back to one. Wowzers. And so what we're seeing here is that that Aeolian is really popular in a variety of different genres. But regardless, it always gives up that same serious, melancholic vibe. Wowzers. Okay, so check it. In the video description below, I've included a playlist of only Aeolian songs for your studying pleasure. This playlist was created by my friend and fellow teacher Matt at Pyramide, who is a modes expert. You can check out more of his work by clicking on some of the other links in the video description. I'm Underbelly. Have a great day.